are people just like not into Halo anymore? Is it like the idea of a good Halo game is like really cool, but does anybody really care at this point? I, it's something I've been thinking about a lot. And before we get, you know, further into the video, let me know in the comments down below how you feel. Do you think that, you know, Halo is just kind of done in terms of it being this super popular pop culture phenomenon kind of thing? Or do you think it still has some life left? Also, if you love Halo content, make sure you sub to the channel. We're on the grind to 15k subs. I know 96% of you watching do not sub to the channel, so just do it. Just help me out. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Anyways, I saw a tweet a couple days ago that made me start pondering this, and the tweet says, I don't think 343 has necessarily made any bad games. I just feel they were left with an aged recipe. I try Infinite nowadays, and while I admit the gameplay is polished and smooth, I feel like they perfected a cocktail I haven't enjoyed since 2010. Not thirsty for it. Now, I'm not going to talk about who this person is. They're not really, I guess, involved in the Halo community. You know, it's kind of an outside perspective. And there were a lot of comments that are like, it's not age, it's not age. Another reply to that tweet was, it's weird, Infinite's numbers dropped two weeks after launch, and I saw a lot of people blame the content and the lack of it. I don't think more maps or game modes would have kept me around. The gameplay just doesn't hit the same, but 2005 me would be crying happy tears. Another comment is Halo gameplay really hasn't changed a lot, and just an aside, I disagree with that. Infinite does feel like a return to the old form, but man, like Reach 4, 5, very different. Uh, they said some things added here and there. Maybe it's because it's been out for so long, but Halo feels outdated. And I think that that may be a sentiment with arena shooters overall. I know that there is a player base for those games, but it just seems like arena shooters in general, you know, the, the prototypical COD multiplayer, Halo, you know, even Destiny's Crucible PvP mode, just feels like it's been an end of an era. It also feels like, you know, maybe even in the esports scene, uh, you know, with games that are as popular as Valorant and Counter-Strike, and then you have MOBAs, it just feels like a casual FPS genre-defining game is just not happening. And don't, don't get it twisted. I love regular, you know, multiplayer games. Arena, 4v4, big team battle... Whatever it is, I those are my bread and butter. I don't know if it's because I'm 75 years old and that's what I grew up on. You know, a lot of people before me that are a little bit older may have loved those super fast, but like Quake and Unreal, those gigantic skill gap Twitch shooter things. It just feels like there's been such a, a changing of the guard. And I know we we meme on the leak or supposed leak that 343 was going to be building a hero shooter type of halo game before they went back to regular multiplayer and you know kind of taking inspiration from things like overwatch i guess or other hero ability kind of focused shooters and man wh what timeline do you think that is in right now where halo released that and that's now like the most popular esport ever there's something special about Halo, and I feel like, you know, we talk about, oh, this is Halo's last chance, you know, if they don't get it right this time, I'm not playing and stuff, and while I do believe that people stop playing, obviously, it just always feels like whenever Halo has a new game, people want to give it a shot. People want to love it, and I think that that's a very unique thing for a franchise. I don't know if it's super comparable, but another franchise I think of is Gears of War and how there was such a dedicated fan base, a casual fan base, you know, like whenever there was a new Gears game that came out, people would buy it, play the story, play multiplayer and stuff. And it felt like it had staying power, but it just feels like that franchise has fallen off. Nothing lasts forever, obviously. And I'm super anxious to see what Halo and certain Affinity's new multiplayer mode is because I think that's probably our last chance, at least with Infinite, um, and getting a huge bump in the player base. But we shall see. Let me know again in the comments down below your opinions. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like it because it helps me a lot. I have a new end screen. I hope you like it. Let me know in the comments down below that as well if you stayed all the way to the end and let me know how bad the end screen looks. Peace.